And you know what? Omosh has come out to apologize to we Kenyans. <laughs> and he said, oh, my, Ke my fellow Kenyans, I'm not going to do this again. I'm not going <laughs> to beg again. All you're going to hear from me is just about entertainment. Yani, I was so shocked. I was like, I nilikuwa nikijuliza surely, what did I do? Ushaifanya kitu mpaka yo mwenye unajichukia. Unafanya kitu alafu, you start wishing you never did it. <laughs> but one thing... Kwani, kwanini walichukulia wali serious is because they gave me their money. They fought for my upcoming again. Kenyans, please, I know you are forgiving. I'm just your brother. Please forgive me. Please, no, but two. I'm sorry. <laughs> you will never hear of that again. You will never hear that from me again. But when you hear from me, it will be entertainment and he confessed about something he said i have been to rehab twice rehab can only be a personal decision i have to involve my family as well no one can be forced to go to rehab i don't see the point of going back to rehab but i think visiting a counselor once in a while would be the best option for me and you know there was a video which was um, doing rounds on social yeah. media where he was um very drunk mm. and has someone had to like shikilia him mm. and he said some of those videos are old and are just being used to escalate the issue it is good for people to ask randomly from neighbors for example that video was coming from a bash and random people decided to record it well i agree some people can just record everything but we don't know if it is recent or it's an old video we don't know because <laughs> omosh basically looks the same the omosh that was was there oh, anyway, yeah. ago, I know, it's, it's still the same, the same. Yeah. it's not like he has tattoos so that we start comparing like okay 2010 he did not have a tattoo but anyway he confessed to to going for um to going to rehab mm -hmm. and i feel like he needs to go back again well he said it's his personal choice i know yeah. i know it's a personal choice yeah. but there's something wrong, even the way he speaks. It's an apology, but it doesn't sound so genuine. Mm. It's like, ah, I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to say it. It's not, he's not remorseful. I, some, I, I still feel there's yeah. something wrong. I really wanted to ask, first of all, what is he apologizing for? Asking for money or tarnishing people's names? after he was given the money, mm. after he was mm -hmm. given the house, after he was given the food, and then he went for an interview. That's why he wronged Kenyans. When mm -hmm. he asked for money, he didn't wrong anyone. He needed help, and he asked for help, and people came through and helped him. His apologies all over the place, mm -hmm. to be honest. It's okay if, if, if I wronged you. If, yeah. If, yeah. You know, kama niliku, yeah. kama una feel niliku kosea, that is kohole. not an apology, yeah. honestly. It's all over the place. He knows the right people. I'm not going to mention the people that he's supposed to apologize to, but Omosh, seriously, uh, you have some growing to do and do another apology. Let it be as loud or as audible as Natakatu Kakamenje Nasijui lights yeah. Nanini. Let it be as loud as that. Let it let it be out there. Not this. This is just all over the place. Yeah, mm, yeah. and honestly, like here's how I know Moshe is not serious. Okay. When you look go to his Twitter, he has still <laughs> has a tweet from six days ago that he has pinned. <laughs> that you can see the first one over there when you go to his Twitter and it yeah. says Kenyans is Sidiani I promise <laughs> this time it's a Japan. Panga. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> this time Tajipanga. And I'm like, if you're really that sorry, so you'd have taken down that tweet. So you'd have just stopped this whole game completely. And I keep on seeing these. He's just making a joke out of it. He's, you know, like saying at CCG that I've been seeing different things over there. Until he's still asking for money and everything. And clearly now it's being seen as a joke. But this is not funny. He was given millions. You know what and I you mean? Know, he said he cannot account for that money. Yeah. And uh, Ati, I'm sorry, I can't account for that money. People give you over a million shillings Imagine. and you can't account. account. Exactly. And then My you have the God. You, you have the nerve to say, huh? You have the nerve to say Ati Nisaidieni Yamusho Ntajipanga this time. <laughs> by the way, just go and go to rehab. Oh, Achao yeah. Jinga, by the way, just go to rehab. You can't start lying to me and saying that that video over there is an old video and everything. Mm -hmm. No, it's not an old video. You clearly have a problem when it comes to alcohol. And you know it's actually a disease as mm -hmm. much as we're here talking about and everything addiction is a disease yeah. and he honestly needs that help
help. Mm -hmm. And I can be sympathetic towards him in terms of like losing the money and you just spending it all on alcohol mm -hmm. and whatever other things that he's done. And I can even see other Kenyans wanting to help him in yeah. order to take him to rehab and stuff. But don't start. Right now, you just have jokes, and I'm not here for the jokes. Me, I'm tired. And to <laughs> rehab, when you come back, yeah. then we can talk. Yeah, and, <laughs> yeah. and you know what? He sorry, he is right that for rehab, you it's a personal decision. You have to 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 decide you, the same way if you want to get saved yeah. you have to, de to decide to receive christ in your heart and all that but then again clearly he is not ready to go for rehab and a counselor will not help you when it comes to alcohol yeah. that yeah. is not the right place it doesn't make sense mm -hmm. 